from uh, my buddy Anthony, so I'm trying that out, but I did a video, posted a video yesterday, and uh, I'll go into that in the next couple videos about uh, something that's kind of means a lot to me and our family. Um, those videos will come up after this, but just wanted to touch base with everybody, and hopefully everybody's enjoying the content we're putting out. Um, probably going to do another video. I won't put it up today, but I'm going to do some work on that, on the Ford truck we got. I'm going to show some of the kids and Anthony, hopefully he'll come over and how to bleed brakes on it. So we'll go into that video next. But uh, like I said, I just want to make sure everybody's, you know, enjoying what we're putting out. And if you want to see something else or something different, you know, put it in the comments. We'll try to get to, try to get to that. Basically, I'm just kind of doing videos of our life and and uh, what we do, how we do it, and it may or may not be the right way, but it's the way we, we do it. And uh, so, yeah, hope everybody's enjoying. And if you haven't hit that subscribe button, hit it. Hit the little bell if you want it to notify you when we, when we do post a video. I try to get at least one video a week up. Sometimes I get more, sometimes less. Let me know what you guys want to see, and I'll just keep posting randomness that we do around here. And uh, oh, one other thing about the video that I did, the last video I did yesterday about moving those yaks, um, after I did that, the last portion of the video where I was cleaning the truck, I took the shovel and, and, and swept out the back of the trailer, got all the old hay and shavings and all the other crap that's in there out, and pressure washed it out. and. Um, it didn't. It actually wasn't that bad. I thought. Uh, I thought it was gonna stink pretty bad from those yaks, but um, I didn't even notice it when I was in there cleaning. So I had to just clarify that up. It wasn't uh, as bad as I thought it was gonna be. So if you want to haul yaks in your trailer, it's not that big a deal. And they were in. They were in my trailer for every bit of two hours or longer, probably. Um, I didn't even really know they were back there. They weren't moving around a bunch. They didn't make a bunch of noise, so it actually traveled pretty well. So anyways, so I'll get to that video that I posted yesterday and uh, of what we got. And hope everybody's enjoying whatever you're doing while you're watching this video. <laughs> Alright, have a good one. God bless y'all. Made it back to our road. Almost home. Stop by the mailbox and uh, for uh, any of you that know me, uh, I've followed the boy Finnicum's life and story and everything that went along with what happened to him. And uh, the wife and I attended his funeral in Utah. I just went by the mail and got uh, picked it up, and I, I uh, you know, go to their website and purchase shirts or stickers or books that have been written from them trying to help support the family and, and Jeanette, his wife. Um, but I just received this in the mail. Christmas card from the Finnicum family and a note saying thanks for all the support that we've given them and continue to give them. Uh, it means a lot to me. It uh, means a lot to me to receive that from them. Um, I try to give what I can uh, to their family and for them to send a Christmas card and a letter thanking me for my support. I mean, that's huge. I believe in everything that LaVoy did and I believe he was wrongfully murdered and it just, uh, like I said, I've tried to support them, the family, and to receive that uh, 
Christmas card was really cool. So I just wanted to, wanted to share that with you guys. If you don't know who Lavoy Finnicum is or the story behind it or what happened to him, do a little research, check it out. Uh, yeah. Have a good one. And if you're interested in ordering any shirts um, or keychains or stickers or you want to learn more, this is a four DVD series, basically the whole story. Um, you can go to onecowboystandforfreedom.com and uh, pick up, you know, like I said, apparel, um, stickers, kind of flags, um, these DVDs, and uh, good prices on everything. Um, I try to go in there and order stuff here and there. Um, I just got a couple shirts, that DVD series, and um, so yeah. Check it out if you want to learn more. OneCowboysStandForFreedom.com